You are not only making our nation wealthier, but you are making America safer by building a future of American energy independence. We are independent. We don't need anybody. We don't need anybody. And we don't need to be ripped off by the rest of the world either, because those days are over. You know, I went around, I used to, especially in my previous life, and now instead of relying on foreign oil and foreign energy, we are now relying on American energy and American workers like never before. And, you know, we work with other countries, and we work with their energy, and we take their energy, we buy it, we produce it. But we don't need to if we don't have to, if we don't want to. It just works out pretty well that way. But anytime we want, we can stop. The energy we produce here in our country is better, cheaper, and cleaner than our foreign competitors. And it's not even close. You people know that better than anybody. It's your business. We're thrilled to be joined by many of the great leaders from <laughs> And now they talk about the Green New Deal. The Green New Deal, everybody go home, you just lost your jobs. The Green New Deal is, that's a hoax, like the hoax I just went through. I'm not even sure, it might be a bigger one. And mine was pretty big, mine was unlimited. Think of it, the Green New Deal, under that deal, I, I didn't have this, this isn't down. But John Kennedy, Bill, under that deal, everybody in this room gets fired. All of the thousands of guys and women standing on these buildings get fired, they go home. Because under the Green New Deal, they don't like clean, beautiful, natural gas. They don't like anything. They don't know what they like. And I told you, great senators, that if we get elected, if I win my race and we get it just the way we want it, and I think we're going to win it big, I'm looking at the competition, you sort of dream about competition like that, but who knows? Who knows? I got boot edge edge. I got them all. I got Beto. Beto. Beto's falling fast. What the hell happened? Remember about four, four weeks ago, he said, I was made for this. He was made for it. He was made to fall like a rock. He, what happened to him? But he's trying to restart his campaign. That generally doesn't work out too well. Political geniuses, when you have to restart your campaign, history has said that that does not work out well, right? History has said that that's trouble. But he's going to restart his campaign. But I'm looking at it. I don't know what the hell happened to Biden. What happened to him? I'm looking. I said, that doesn't look like the guy I knew. What happened to him? And Bernie, you know, Bernie's crazy. <laughs> Bernie's crazy. But Bernie's got a lot more energy than Biden, so you never know. No, no, Bernie's got a lot of energy. But it's energy to get rid of your jobs. He's got the opposite energy that you produce. Not good energy. You don't like his energy. But, you know, so it's going to be one of these people. Uh, Pocahontas, I think, is probably out. <laughs> Boy, you got some beauties here. 350 million people, and that's the best we can do. I don't think so. Even as Democrats, I could pick better than that.